Hello everyone. Thank you for joining me for another video. This is Elizabeth. So I'm preparing some oxtail. So I'm going to show how I prepare my oxtail. So the first thing I'm going to do is trim off the fat. I'll cut the excess fat off from the sides. I have one lemon. Just gonna roll it to ensure I get the juice out. Cut it. So I squeeze it over my hands to ensure I don't get the seed in the oxtail. cleaning off my fat washing it in my oxtail with some lemon now I'm gonna season with dry seasoning so I'll start with my paprika onion powder seasoning salt a little black pepper Add some brown sugar. So I let this oxtail sit, this seasoning sit for 30 minutes. And I will add the oxtail just to get them brown. So I just need them brown on both sides. So I'll start with this side first. So a few minutes later, so now I'll split them and I'll let the other side go. So 20 minutes later, checking them and turning them. <clears throat> and with the help of the brown sugar, I have a really nice sear on them. So now I'll, I don't have much oil, just have a little oil in the pan, so I don't have to drain the oil. Now I'll add my green seasoning, my garlic paste, my allspice, some water and just let it cook. So now I'll add my green seasoning. This is my special green seasoning. Garlic paste. I'm not gonna add any scotch bonnet to this because my green seasoning garlic paste has scotch bonnet pepper in it. A little black pepper. The onion powder that I had left over. A little seasoning salt. And just a little browning. I just drizzle it because I don't need a lot. Uh, 
maybe a teaspoon or half of a teaspoon. So now I'll mix this in, add some water and just let it cook. So the color is beautiful. So if this was a lot of oxtail, I would now add this to a pressure pot, but it's not a lot. So I'll cook it in this pan. The garlic and the green seasoning smells so good. And I'll add some thyme and some water. So now I'll add a little ketchup. Already add some brown sugar. Some water. So it's better if you add some hot water to, to your oxtail while it's cooking. So I let this cook, do a final taste test. I'll add some onions, my butter beans, some bell peppers in the next hour or so. I have some dry thyme. I'm gonna add this to my oxtail. So I let this cook for half an hour or so and check on it. I'll prepare my veggies, my bell peppers and carrots. So another way I prepare my oxtail is the old fashioned way where instead of using brown, instead of using any coloring, I just use brown sugar. I'm just gonna add a little carrot, two carrots, my bell pepper, the seeds aside so when the meat is tender there's a black part there when the meat is tender I'll add my veggies and my butter bean of butter beans so I'll wash this and I'll add it to my oxtail when it's tender